Hi, it's Steve Sorensen at Phillips Chevrolet in Frankfurt, Illinois. Uh, I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about the Corvettes. Uh, a lot of people say there's a lot of different levels of Corvette that you can buy. Um, I'm standing in front of a Z06. The Z06 is probably is, is the top of the line Corvette. It's the got the most horsepower, most torque, most horsepower, and most torque of any of the Corvettes that are made. Um, the different levels of Corvette are this. You've got a Stingray, just a regular 6.2 liter eight-cylinder engine, 455 horse, 455 pounds of torque, okay? Stingray comes in three different levels. It comes in a 1LT, comes in a 2LT, comes in a 3LT. Sometimes they call it 1LZ, 2LZ, 3LZ. It's one, two, three, basically. When you do a one, let's say that this car had red interior in it. When you do a one, the car does not come with any heads-up display. It does come with leather seats, and the leather's gonna be Mulan leather. And let's say that this is a 1LE. What happens is, is the seats are gonna be red, okay? And the door panels are gonna stay black, and it's a Mulan leather seat. Now, when you go to a 2LT, um, or a 2LZ, whatever you wanna call it, the door panels now become red, the seats are red, the armrest is red, and the other seat and the other door panels are all red, all right? Then you also get into heads-up display and um, options for different wheels also. Now, a 3LT is basically a 2LT with Napa leather instead of Mulan leather, and it also has the video data recorder navigation system standard in it. So if you get a 2LT and you add video, and data recorder and navigation to the system, the only difference between the car is really the, the type of leather that's in the car. It's a Mulan leather versus a Napa leather. So that's basically the only difference in the car. But also a 3LT, the red would actually go up in the dash too. So that's basically the difference in the regular Stingray. Now, you could also jump up to what they call a Grand Sport. And Grand Sport, it's got the Stingray engine. It's a non-supercharged 6.2 V8 engine, 455 horse, 460 pounds of torque, right around that ballpark. But what it does have is it does have the Z06 chassis. And what it does, it gives you the, the, the Grand Sport's gonna have the wider wheel wells, the fender wells, it's gonna have the bigger tires, it's gonna have the bigger, the, the ceramic brakes, the six piston, uh, uh, Brembo's in the front, the four in the back, but the Stingray's also got that. But you go with the bigger brake rotor also, a larger brake rotor for, with ceramic brakes for extra stopping power because now you're, you're dealing with more of a, um, a, a chassis that can handle more lateral G's and come into a corner faster. So you're going to need bigger brakes to come down into that to, you know, you can come in faster to handle the turns. So a Grand Sport's basically got the Stingray engine and it's got the Z06 chassis. Then you jump up to a Z06. It's a Grand Sport, with basically a supercharger on it. And it jumps up the horsepower and torque of the engine to 650 horsepower. All the vehicles are um, available in a 1LZ, 2LZ, 3LZ. Trim levels are pretty much the same. Z06, when you get colored interior, we'll put color on the dash, I believe, in all leather, uh, in all levels of trim. Um, but I gotta check on that, so don't quote me on that. I've still got, there's so much to learn on these cars. Um, if you have any questions, um, my name is Steve Sorensen at Phillips Chevrolet in Frankfurt. Give me a call. It's 815-469-2323, extension 398. Have a great day.